Welcome to the channel, Royally Rich Persons News. Get only the most current information. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell. Netflix documentary, Live to Lead. The film features footage of Mandela leaving prison in 1990 and quotes him throughout. In an interview with the Australian newspaper, Nalika stated that she was frustrated with the Sussexes appearing to compare their own experiences in the royal family to Mandela's long walk to freedom, calling it upsetting and tedious. Nalika also questioned whether or not Harry and Meghan had actually met Mandela, stating that she does not believe they had a proper encounter with him. This is not the first time the couple has faced backlash from the Mandela family. In August, Meghan's suggestion that her wedding to Harry prompted celebrations in South Africa led to backlash and the trending hashtag vote said Meghan, which means go away or get lost in Afrikaans. It is clear that Nalika Mandela is unhappy with the way in which her grandfather's legacy has been utilized by the Sussexes in their new documentary. It is understandable that Nalika would want to protect and preserve the memory of her grandfather, especially given his immense impact and importance on the world stage. However, it is also important to recognize that Mandela's legacy can be used in a variety of ways to inspire and educate people. Despite this controversy, it is worth noting that the Nelson Mandela Foundation did support the Sussexes documentary and the couple are listed as executive producers on the film. It is also worth considering that the Sussexes have faced a significant amount of criticism and negative attention in the media, particularly since their decision to step down as senior members of the royal family. It is possible that the couple saw Mandela as a source of inspiration and guidance as they navigated their own challenges and struggles. In conclusion, it is important to approach this situation with sensitivity and understanding. It is understandable that Nalika Mandela would want to protect her grandfather's legacy, but it is also important to recognize the potential for Mandela's message to inspire and educate others. It will be interesting to see how this situation develops and if the Sussexes choose to address Nalika's accusations. Thanks for watching the channel, Royally Rich Persons News. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell.